Six American items banned in other countries. Number six. Ketchup is probably one of the most famous condiments worldwide, along with its counterpart mustard. From putting it on hot dogs and hamburgers to using the item as a base for sauce, or even for the more simple use of dipping french fries, ketchup is renowned for the role it plays in the dining experience. While ketchup can be found at any stadium during game day, in 2011, France banned ketchup from school cafeterias. The reason behind this? According to France, ketchup was banned in an effort to preserve the quality and authenticity of French cuisine. Although the item is banned, it is only acceptable when using with French fries. Pretty ironic, but also understandable, because what's a good side of French fries without a cool, refreshing condiment like ketchup? Number five, salmon is one of the more popular seafood dishes worldwide. From the taste to its nutritional value, salmon has become a staple in the culinary world. While salmon is popular, its popularity and high demand has led to farmers raising salmon as opposed to relying on freshwater fish. Farm-raised salmon sounds innocent enough, but it actually has raised red flags and has led to some countries banning the act. The argument states that farm-raised seafood is friendly and better for consumption because of pollution and dumping in the ocean and fresh bodies of water. However, wild-caught salmon has many more health benefits. Farm-raised salmon contains more fat than wild-caught, although it contains less helpful, healthy omega fats and protein. Farm-raised salmon also contains toxins that can be stored in your body and passed down to children through the form of breast milk for women. Countries like Australia, New Zealand, and Russia have moved to ban farm-raised salmon. Number four. If you live in America, you probably never paid attention to what light bulbs you use because using incandescent light bulbs is so common. But if you live in another country, then these light bulbs cease to exist for you. While Thomas Edison is one of the biggest well-known American inventors and has been credited with the creation of incandescent light bulbs, although there have been various refutes and debate about who created the first light bulb, these light bulbs have been called inefficient and ineffective when compared to other light bulbs that convert more of its energy into light opposed to heat. Among the countries that have banned the common American light bulb is Cuba, Argentina, and some countries of the EU. Cuba was the first to ban incandescent light bulbs when it transitioned to CFLs with Argentina following in 2010 and some EU countries completing the final stages of this process in 2012. For America to be viewed as a progressive country, it doesn't hold a torch in this light. Number three. If you thought chewing gum was an innocent act and didn't come with any consequences, then you're wrong. While the chewy candy comes in various shapes, sizes, and flavors, this item has been banned in Singapore. The act of chewing gum was not banned per se, but importing and selling Bazooka Joe bubblegum was put into effect in 1992. Although Singapore did slightly change the law in 2004, there are still rules in effect to regulate the consumption and use of chewing gum. Pro to the law, any Singaporean interested in the health benefits of sugar-free gum can now get a prescription, which would allow them consumption of chewing gum. While Singaporeans can get a prescription, they're still not off the hook. They can still face penalties and fines if they're caught littering with chewing gum. Must be nice to have streets not filled with chewing gum to ruin your new pair of shoes. Number two, if you're a parent of a small child, then you might want to rethink moving to Canada. In 2004, Canada banned baby walkers because of the inconvenience the item causes, which is pretty ironic since the item was created to help parents teach small children how to walk and maintain their balance. Baby walkers were banned because they are said to put babies in danger and delay motor and mental development. If these reasons aren't enough to stop someone from using a baby walker, maybe the fine of up to $100,000 or possible jail time of up to six months might make you reconsider. While parents might gripe about teaching their young children how to walk the old fashioned way, hopefully they'll see the sacrifice to keep their children out of harm's way and their mental well-being as a way to cope with the lack of baby walkers. Number one, referred to as business in the front and a party in the back, the mullet has become a staple in American lifestyle. While the hairstyle is only popular in particular regions of the country, mainly the southern states and areas known for the country rural life, mullets have always been associated as an American item. In 2010, 
the Islamic Republic of Iran banned mullets and labeled them as decadent. Other hairstyles banned are spikes and ponytails. Want to rebel and get one of these banned hairstyles as a way to stand out? Then prepare for a fine, as well as having to change your hairstyle.